In this video we're going to look at power consumption of the Pi and the monitor. So this in out is pretty much my full setup. I've got my two power converters in here dropping from battery power um, 12 volts to 14 volts down to 5 volts and I've got a small meter that's just plugged in here so we can see how much the Pi is drawing and also the voltage. I've got a second one of these that is giving me a, a straight 12 volts to my monitor so that that doesn't go um, much above 12. This is my temperature sensor um, that I had plugged in upstairs and it's one of the one wire temperature sensors. So the second part of this here is a um, device that can talk to C-Talk and this is the C-Talk cable. Um, somebody's done a really good video on this this little unit, it's only a couple of pounds and essentially you can get the data from your C-Talk network with some configuration in Signal K um, into your Pi just by using this rather than buying a, a more expensive device. This is my Victron cable which is which was about £30. You can make these um, but I decided not to, I decided to purchase mine. Um, that's plugged into my USB port. Here's my um, BME 280 temperature sensor um, and that's doing pressure, humidity and temperature. Um, keyboard which is just a small wireless keyboard plugged in and this is my power supply and the monitors at the back. So first things first we're going to have a look at the battery um, and we're going to do a couple of tests on the battery just to show what the voltage is at the moment and then we'll turn the battery charger on to show how things change. So with my trusty cheap meter connected um, we can see there that we've got um, around 12.7 volts just straight from the battery. So if I turn on the charger We can see that straight away that's gone up to 14 volts. So these are the types of changes in voltage that you've got to consider when you're powering more sensitive equipment, um, such as things on the Raspberry Pi um, and other computing type equipment on, on board a boat, for example. Okay, so the charge is back off and the voltage is dropping away. So what we'll do now is we'll connect up um, these two devices here um, up to the battery um, and then we'll show what voltage we're getting um, on the USB side. Okay, so as you can see, we've got both um, units powered up now. We've got blue lights on each. Um, and the top one is currently giving 5.16 volts. So as you can see here, 5.16 volts, or 5.15 volts here. 12.75 on the battery. So let's put the charger back on. Battery voltage starting to go up now, 14.4. 5.16 still here so that's working as expected and just to confirm on the output to the monitor 12.14 so we've got everything connected up now we've got the meter um, here set to amp so we can see what power we're drawing so at the moment um, that would be one amp that would be 0.1 of an amp so it's 0.05 amps being drawn at the moment to power these two devices and the small USB. So There's probably a little bit of power going to the back of that monitor as well to be fair. Okay so we're ready to power up. Pi starting to boot and you can see about half an amp being drawn with the screen on and the Pi booting around 0.49 at 5 volts and the combination of the screen and the Pi about half an amp at 12 volts a bit higher now here as we get to the final sort of stages of booting Pi is running through its checks We're roughly maintaining 5.1, just dips ever so slightly every so often. But over on this side, really, if we measured here, it'd be slightly less on the Pi's pins. But that's fine, that's that's well within tolerance, we're not getting any low power warnings. Okay, so the Pi's booted up. So as the system settles, we're drawing about half an amp still. 
and the Pi is drawing about 0 0.3, 0 0.4 of an amp. So I'll load the charts. So the Pi is just loading um, open CPN. now loaded. Let's turn the screen off and see what the, that does to the overall consumption. So as you can see it's actually the screen that's drawing quite a bit of power really out of that. It's about 0.2. That's settled a little bit to be fair but that'll probably jump up a little bit. 